In this video, let's talk about the size and dimension for this banner image so that when you have it created either by yourself or by a freelancer, you will know exactly the dimensions that you need. This video is brought to you by EpiPies Academy. So there are different Facebook banner image sizes because some people will look at your page on mobile, some on desktop, and all of them will have different screen sizes. And the banner adjusts, Facebook adjusts the dimensions depending on the size of the screen of the device. So on desktop, the entire width is displayed and the height is typically chopped off. On mobile, the height is typically preserved or chopped off a little bit, but the width is chopped off by quite a bit. What happens is you have to direct your freelancer or whoever is going to create your banner to create what's called a safe zone inside the image middle so that it doesn't get cut off from any angle from on top, on the widths, depending on the devices. So let's talk about the banner safe zone. It's typically 640 pixels by 312 pixels. That's where you can feel good about whatever's in there. It's not going to get cut off. The typical cutoff that's going to happen is approximately 90 pixels on the left and to the right, if on mobile, and approximately 24 pixels on the top and bottom. So you can create a larger image and it's going to get cut off by these dimensions if necessary, if it's deemed necessary by Facebook. So basically don't add anything that's really valuable for your brand, 90 pixels to the left, 90 pixels to the right, or 24 pixels on top and 24 pixels on the bottom. And that's the dimensions of the banner image of your page. 